Hey yo, what's happening guys? It's your boy Nick Che coming back with another video. Today we are doing a top 10 gift guides for guys and girls alike, especially for a college budget. I know with Valentine's Day coming around the corner, a lot of you guys might be wondering, you know, what do I get my significant other? What do I get, you know, a girlfriend, boyfriend, or even your mom? So today I'm gonna be breaking down a bunch of different great gift options that every guy and girl will love. Now keep in mind that this is going to be a wide variety of things and depending on your budget, it may vary. So, you know, keep that in mind and I hope you guys enjoy. One other quick note, a lot of you guys have been asking me how I edit my photos so I've been working really hard on developing my Lightroom presets now they are almost done but I'm waiting till I hit 50k to release them so if you guys want to see them make sure you hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for some more content also follow me on the gram at Nicholas Che I post tons of content on there now to start it off simple as a photographer one of my favorite gifts and something that I've you know continuously done throughout the years is a photo album now photo albums are a great way to capture and relive a lot of your memories especially if you have a boyfriend or girlfriend you know the pictures you've taken on cute dates or when you go on trips together like that is a really amazing gift It'll take a lot of effort or money to make because you can make them at Walgreens or CVS there are literally dozens of companies that will make them for you so all you have to do is kind of lay them out figure out which photos you want to do and you know write a short message in it and honestly like your significant other will love that now when it comes to Valentine's Day or gifts in general, it's really the thought that matters. Like you don't need to be spending hundreds of dollars to go get your girlfriend like this brand new necklace when in reality, she's gonna appreciate the little things, like the little sentiments that will remind her that you actually thought of her, that you know, when you're picking out this gift, you did it with intention, not a last minute, oh crap, what do I get? Let me just run to the store and pick out the first necklace I see. So along those lines, like flowers, cards, handwritten notes, candles, or little jokes that you have, or you know, some memorabilia from the first date you guys went on together, like the little things like that to you know show her that you really thought about your gift that you put a lot of intention to it and that you know you came from the heart is going to matter the most and honestly she will probably like that a lot more than you spending you know hundreds of dollars on something that you didn't really put a lot of thought or effort to and you just thought that she was going to like now number three this is a really great gift for guys in general and it's something called a dop kit now a dop kit is essentially something you take when you go on travel or you put your accessories or your toiletries in there and it just makes it a lot easier for you to carry around your accessories especially when you travel so if your boyfriend's super messy and he can't keep track of his razor and his toothbrush and his colognes then getting him something like a leather dop kit you know even with his initials in it or something um, that's gonna be something he's going to remember every time he uses it and it's a great gift it's something that I personally would love to get now moving up into a little higher price range obviously if your significant other has been eyeing you know some software or some tech or some materials that will really help them elevate their craft as an artist or you know even as a musician or, or photographer or filmmaker then you know buying some accessories for that so some examples are if they need a new tripod if they need a new microphone you know if you want to buy them Final Cut Pro like that's awesome gifts honestly my top pick for tech if your boyfriend or girlfriend doesn't have consistent headphones that they're using I would recommend AirPods now you guys know how much I rave about these bad boys because honestly like they are lifesavers they're 170 180 dollars so they are in the higher price range but if you guys have been dating for a while then honestly like this could be a great Valentine's gift Next up, ladies, if you're on a date with a guy and he pulls out a Velcro wallet or a duct tape wallet, either one, you need to dump his ass or two, you need to get him a new wallet. That's why I think that leather card holders or leather wallets are a really great option. They're not too expensive. And honestly, a wallet is something that a guy uses just about every day. Now, the one that I have is a Saint Laurent card holder. I got this when I was in Paris. And honestly, this is a daily driver. It's in my back pocket every single day because it carries my you know, university ID, my credit cards, my debit cards. And having something like this has honestly been a lifesaver. Now, obviously, you don't need to go Saint Laurent there are dozens of different companies that make great wallets but I recommend something slim something portable and something that will allow them to keep both cards and cash in there now moving on this is a great gift for both guys and girls alike but obviously a watch now a watch is an essential piece in any person's wardrobe because it honestly like attracts a lot of attention when you wear a nice watch on your wrist if, especially if you have your sleeves rolled up or something or you're at a business convention or a nice dinner people will be like wow that is a really nice watch and then you can be like oh thanks my girlfriend got it for me now the one that I've been rocking lately is the one from our sponsor rolls golden black you know I've talked about them making accessories and bracelets and necklaces but they have recently just come out with their watch collection and honestly these are pretty badass now the reason I love this watch is because they're not like a lot of traditional watch brands they paid really close attention to every single detail including the knobs and the screws and everything about this watch makes it feel sturdy professional and it looks like a million bucks now as of right now they have released them in two different colors so this is the all black one and this is the rose gold one now honestly the color preference is totally up to you depending on which one you think will match your outfits the best and guys even if you don't have a girlfriend these are awesome watches just to pick up for yourself because 
like I said, having a nice watch will get you so many compliments and who knows, might even get you a Valentine's this year. Now, if you're looking for a last minute gift, I promise that a watch from Rolls Gold and Black is a great option. I will have the link in my description down below, so make sure you guys go check them out. Next up, I think that every guy and girl should have at least one cologne and one perfume. Now, shopping for fragrances for your significant other without them there can be a little hard, so it wouldn't be a bad idea to just go fragrance shopping, ask your significant other, you know, hey, what do you think about this perfume? What do you think about this cologne? Now, I have a couple different colognes depending on the occasion and what I'm wearing it for, but the ones that I personally use are Polo Ralph Lauren, the blue edition. This is if I'm going on a date, going out with friends, going out at night like this is a really manly cologne that smells great on the skin next up calvin klein the one is a really good everyday scent because it's very clean it's very fresh and isn't too overwhelming Another great option and cheap alternative is the Perry Ellis 360. This goes on Amazon for about $30 to $40. So if you are looking for a great cologne to start off with, I highly recommend this one. Um, it lasts really long and the fragrance isn't too soft or too strong. So it's a really great one to start off with. Now, finally, I think a duffel bag is a really great gift for any college kid in general, just because you can be going on weekend trips. You might be going home for the weekend and you don't want to carry an entire suitcase. So having a nice duffel bag to carry your clothes in is an essential. Now the one I have is from ASOS. It's this black leather and it fits, you know, a few different outfits and um, most of the stuff that I need, especially if I'm going on a weekend trip. So getting your boyfriend or girlfriend a duffel bag or even like a small backpack is not a bad idea. Kind of some last miscellaneous items are obviously jewelry, accessories, or clothes. You know, guys going to Kendra Scott and getting a nice necklace. Girls would love that. Earrings are also a great option. Girls, if you want to get your guys some scarves, some gloves, like those are also really great options, especially in the winter. As far as clothes, hopefully you know your significant other style and you can pick something out best for them. Guys may not be the best judge of this. Girls probably will know what looks good on their boyfriends, so take that into consideration. Anyways, that about wraps up this college edition of gift guides. I know with Valentine's Day coming around the corner, it can be stressful picking out gifts for your girlfriend or boyfriend. Sadly, I will be spending Valentine's Day alone, but I have you guys, so make sure to leave a comment down below of your top item and why you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more videos, and as always, don't stress. Finesse.